With a little behind-the-scenes preparation, you can use your Adobe Sign account directly within Workday to seamlessly manage all your HR paperwork. There are two things you need to do in your Adobe Sign account in order to get the integration up and running. The first step is to create a new user within your account who will be the dedicated account administrator and hold the integration key. For this new account, you can use or create a perfunctory email address to handle this administrative role, rather than assigning the role to a specific person on your team. For example, in this case I'll use the generic account I have created explicitly for this role. This way, I'll reduce the risk of anyone's personal account getting disabled and therefore disabling the whole integration. As long as you maintain access to this generic email account, you won't have any trouble. As I'm entering this new account's information, I have the option to create a new group for this user. And this is the second thing you'll need. A new, Workday-specific group in your Adobe Sign account. To make things easy for yourself, you should probably name this new group something obvious, like, say, Workday. Now you can click Save. You'll see the new user appear in the account with the status Created. You'll have to log in to your new email account and go through the steps to create a new Adobe Sign password, which will change the account status to Active. Back in your Adobe Sign account, you've got one more thing to do for your new user. Make it a Group Administrator. From your Users page in your profile, Navigate to your new user in the Workday group and double-click. In the User Permissions, check the box marked User is a Group Administrator. Now, click Save. So, we've created a new group for Workday and defined the Group Administrator who will hold the integration key. Now, how do we generate the integration key? Not so fast. Before we can move forward, we need to contact Adobe Support and have this group and administrator configured on the back end for use with Workday. If you know your success manager, go ahead and reach out to them to get this done. If not, you can reach out to Adobe Support directly and let them know the name of the group and the email address of the new account admin. In this same email, and this is very important, you should also request that all email notifications get turned off. Otherwise, you might get stuck in a strange loop as you go through this integration setup. When this step is done, sign into your new Group Admins account and open My Profile. Now, under Personal Preferences, click Access Tokens. This is where we generate the integration key. You'll know the account has been configured correctly by support when you see the plus sign in the upper right. Click it once to bring up the Create Integration Key dialog box. In here, start by naming the integration key, again with something obvious, like Workday. There are five elements you need to enable here. Agreement Read, Agreement Write, Agreement Send, Widget Read, and Library Read. Tick these five boxes and then click Save. You'll be back in the Access Tokens section of your Preferences where you'll see your new Workday item. Click the link marked Integration Key or double-click this item. You'll see your new Integration Key, which you should copy and then paste somewhere secure where you can access it in the next step. Now that we've completed all the steps necessary within Adobe Sign, let's log into our Workday Admin account to install the Integration Key. Once we've done this, any business process in Workday can include a Review Document step to collect an electronic signature. In your Workday account, do a quick search for Edit Tenant Setup Business Processes. This will bring up the page we need to edit to hook up Adobe Sign. Scroll down to the item labeled eSign Configuration. Paste the integration key in here, and then in the next box enter the email address of the Workday Group admin that we just created. Now, click OK, and that's it. You've successfully enabled Adobe Sign within Workday, allowing you to add e-signature functionality to any business process.